straight strong starts and he is our GMC truck starting pitcher. At second base at shortstop and at third base for Oakland. A ground ball struck to the second baseman Meiser is tourist and one down. Just hey, the offense have carried him all year. Now it's time for the pitching to step up. Where did that mean? Oh, there it is. I was going to say, that's right down in the middle. <laughs> this guy, he's fun. Ice. Wow. And Suzuki takes it almost square in the back on a 1 1 fastball, and Suzuki is with a big ouch. There is no bad blood between these two organizations. They respect each other a lot, and they have in the past competed for so many Western titles. They go away and wow, Cust even knew that. McClellan didn't even have to make the call physically, and Cust was walking back to Santana strikes out to right-hander Trevor Hill out of Oceanside, California. Trevor Cahill, he's a kid that's learning. Outside, ball four. Figgins walks for the 78th time this year. <laughs> But he's man. five years older than that, but net right now he's pitching like a high school player as he's walked the first two batters for the Angels, Mazzaro and Gonzalez. A swing and a miss, and down goes Torrey Hunter. So a big strikeout by Cahill here in the first. Uh-oh. They have Figgins picked off, and he is out at second base. Okay, Trevor Cahill had an idea. Figgy might be trying to leave with two outs and he, he got a little early jump but Cahill had a good little inside turn there. Look at Figgy. He's thinking about going sure enough and then Cahill almost took too much time. The throw was good and what was uh, interesting about the throw was that Cahill made that throw off balance. Up 300 plus 25 home runs each of the last 11 years. Abreu goes a ground ball struck to Adam Kennedy throws out Vlad Guerrero. The inning is over for the Angels. They threaten but do not score against Every pitch from the same angle. Pops up Hairston. Mathis back. Does he have room? Yes, he does. Up against the screen. One out. And he rips that one high and deep. And that ball is way out of here. Sweeney. He's hitting 444 career versus Irvin. Found one he liked. First home run he's hit off him, but he was four for nine coming into that at bat. And that was a no doubter. Sixth batter of the game. Nice easy stroke. He hit it to a deep part of the yard. Goes to tell you, if you're a hitter, you're looking for a pitch and you get it, most of the time they hit it. Line drive to Eric Ibar. Two outs now in the second inning. Have hit eight homers as well. There's a line drive back up the middle past Ibar into center field. So a lefty gets a base hit to center. That's Derek Barton. With Tomko against Bell and Mazzaro against Weaver. Then Sunday afternoon, Anderson against Lackey. Fastball in there. Strike three called. All three strikeouts by Santana have been looking. But Sweeney takes him deep. They're happy to, to announce that he's back with the organization. Adam Kennedy throws out Juan Rivera going to the Dominican Republic and signing with the Angels. That is a high fly ball to right field. Ryan Sweeney near the warning track pulls it down for out number two. Popped him up. Center field. Rajay Davis makes the catch. The Angels go down quickly and quietly in the second inning with open leading one nothing. Batting and home runs and RBIs and runs scored. You did it all as a catcher and an outfielder. Here's a base hit very quickly by Oakland's Adam Kennedy. He's on for the first time, but Brian. And I stunk. And I, I went to Magnolia High School here and only made the varsity my senior year. Pounded out 230. So I really never thought about it. My favorite here was Gene Autry. <laughs> Here's Kurt Suzuki, who got hit by a pitch his first time up, and now he launches one to deep center, but. Torrey Hunter with eight gold gloves in his past. His timing is incredible, and he makes that terrific catch at the wall to Rob Suzuki in the third. Brian, they show a lot of past plays uh, from Angel days and your days, and that reminded me of the Freddie Lynn catch that you and him almost climbed in left center field. You know, what was that like? And that was one of the most spectacular uh, uh, plays ever, Just watching Hunter go back to the wall. Well, the, the beauty of that is we were fighting for the pennant. 
and we were in the last week or two of the season and we were playing our rival Kansas City and we were fighting for the pennant and it was up until the last day of the season. Runner goes throw to second. It is not in time. A stolen base for Adam Kennedy. And missed basically that whole year. Because he is one of the funniest guys in the game. Ground ball struck to Derek Barton and Eric Ibar is out. Angels fantasy camp. Here's a fly ball struck to right field. Ryan Sweeney under it and Ryan will pull it down for out number two. In the air, left center, Scott Hairston pulls it down. Hit high in the air and deep to left center. Juan Rivera is back at the wall to pull it down, out number one. Uh, restless right now in the fourth inning, not having a hit or a run. A flare to left field with two strikes on him, and Sweeney is two for two. And speaking of the fans, and a high on base percentage. That door slider misses inside. They were sending Sweeney. He will take second base because it's a walk to Ellis. That's challenging. He went on a bad pitch. That would have been the ball four and loaded the bases. But the 30th pitch this inning coming from Irvin to the Oakland A's. Pennington went on the slider and strikes out. Back to back, Casey, a six strikeouts in tonight's ball game, but he needs 30 pitches to get through the four. He's working ahead of guys. One, two to Bobby Abreu. It is in there. Strike three call. Trevor Cahill. On 3 1, Hunter grounds out to short, and Cahill continues his excellence against the Angels. Vlad Guerrero breaks up the no hitter with a broken back single to left center field. Look at that great low ball hitter. Buddy loves everything down low. Of course, you know, he hasn't been able to catch up to the mid 90s fastball around the letters, but they did not score. The 1 2 is hammered to third. Kennedy has it, his long throw. In time, the inning is over. We head to the fifth. It's Oakland 1, the Angels nothing, back to four. All time winning is pitcher Chuck Finley with 165 wins and Adam Kennedy meantime picks up his second base hit of the game to lead off number five. So that yeah. almost got it HUD. That's crazy. Ball is popped up left side Eric Ibar should take care of Rajay Davis and he does. He's, his upside is unbelievable. I know he's been hurt a little bit but he seems to repeat his mechanics. Look lot. at Sean Figgins. He will not get the out, but just a tremendous play by Sean. I'm having a great time. I mean, people keep saying, why don't you go back to work, do this? And I'm like, you know, why? I don't, I don't understand why, but yeah. I worked for 18 straight years. Hey, Finn, I, I, I tell Fizz. Smitty came up with all those jerseys over his head. It was <laughs> the funniest thing ever. But Smitty is a great man. Six, four, great dig by Morales to get Santana out of a jam. But went three for three off with Cahill the first time they met, and he rolls this one to second base, and Ellis takes care of Kendry. One out. And they had to beat a team from Rancho Santa Margarita to get there. Here's the pitch. The one hop smash to Ellis, and quickly two outs, and Cahill doing a tremendous job. This is one of his better starts of the year. Now, and he said, you might be seeing a, the second coming of Mulder, Zito, and Hudson, who were dominant. In the early part of this decade, a beautiful one, two, three inning for he's two for two with a home run and a single. Sweeney's blast to left center, the difference in the game, and here's another rope to left field, and that's over the head of Juan Rivera. So Ryan Sweeney not stopping at second base. He's going for three, and he will make it with a triple. So he is a double shy of the cycle, and what a night! By Ryan Sweeney against Irvin Santana. Ground ball, short. Ibar holds the runner, throw to first, just barely in time, and another great pick by Kendry Morales at first base. And that ball is knocked to right center field by Barton. Got a pitch up, and that hurt him, and that knocks in Ryan Sweeney to make it two nothing, Oakland. A bunt try. Mathis collects the baseball, throw to first base in time, and 
Pennington is the second man out, although he does move Barton into scoring position, and he was named ALCS MVP. Pops this one up left side. Ibar sprints out. Rivera is going to let him have it, and Eric makes the catch, but one run on two hits. Through is when they get a guy. How about Jeff Mathis gets him to left center field and deep and up against the wall. So a good start for the Angels here in the bottom of the sixth. And he's playing in. A chopper to the right side. This will get Mathis to third. Figgins is the first out. He wants his pitch. Popped him up. Wow. Cahill just getting out of jam. He got out of a jam in the first inning and now two thirds of out of a jam here in the sixth inning. A chopper to third. Kennedy comes in, flips to first, gets his man. The Angels threat. Looked great yesterday. And he's going to be a huge factor down the way. Palmer covers. They get there in time to get the speedy Rajay Davis. Kurt Suzuki. Takes one right back up the middle as Torres gives it to Ibar. Oh my goodness, what a play! Shock the house. Cheese and crackers, and while you're at it and eating them, call the cops. It's unbelievable. Meister not only robbed a knock, but he says, Look, I'm. I'm a little bit slow getting up. Why don't you take it, Eric? Unbelievable. Look at these two guys. Wizardry. Wizardry like that. That's beautiful. Morales will take it himself. Angel fans applaud. Fine defense. He had a broken bat single, and Jeff Mathis had a booming double. Here's a swing and a drive to left center field. Racing over Scott Hairston. Will they get there? Yes, he does. Fine sliding catch. Round out to third as Kennedy throws out Juan Rivera. Hitters trying to pull the sinker again. Three up, three down. Cahill's best performance of the year. The singer. Line drive caught by Sean Figgins. Harrison is the first out of the eighth inning. Ground ball, second base as Terrace eats it up, and Sweeney is the second out. Palmer, five up, five down. Eric. Fielded it, held the runner at third. Now Eric is going to take care of Mark Ellis again. Three up, three down. Bottom eight we go. Angels need some runs. Meiser is tourist, sends it to center field where Rajay Davis is, and there is out number one. Ibar trying to dump it to center field, but nope, stays up for Rajay Davis, and very quickly two outs in the bottom half of the eighth. Wow, great stuff. I wonder if they'll keep him on for the ninth. They should. He's Woo. that good. Tanner gave him six. There's a ground ball short. I bar one hands it. One out. The Angels offense, they gave up two runs. They win about 90% of those, but starting pitcher Kay Hill and Michael Wirtz in the eighth have been broadcast last year. He's a big fan of Artie Moreno. And what the Angels are doing. Matt Palmer, three perfect innings, outstanding job. And he's dealing strikes, and a curveball struck to second. Figgins is out, one down in the ninth. In the air, left center, backing up the left fielder, Hairston, two outs. Hunter bunning his way on, picked up by the pitcher, he's got no chance. Base hit for Torrey with two out. And Bailey's limping. And Bailey is limping. That's up the middle, but it hits off the mound right to Ellis and ends the ball game. Not tonight for the Angels and a well pitched ball game by the Oakland A's three pitchers. Good job. They need to be credited heavily for that to hold down and shut out for just the fourth time one of the best offenses in baseball.